Hey, Justin, uh, just how tough today was it uh, just trying to defend Jonathan Adams? Um, it was really tough. Um, felt like we started off pretty good as a defense and kind of got like lackadaisical in areas. And we just got to continue fighting throughout the, the entire game. Uh, just felt felt good being back out there specifically for me, just being able to uh, be out there on the field with my brothers and uh, just, I'm just blessed to be out here, you know, win or lose, I'm blessed to be out here to be able to play the game that I love, so. How much do you think it hurt you guys as a defense just knowing that, you know, if, if certain restrictions weren't in place, it would have been a lot harder for their offense to find, maybe be able to communicate as well because it would have been so loud with a lot more fans here. Yeah, uh, it's a lot of variables with uh, everything going on right now. Uh, we got guys who have to step up because of injuries or quarantine or uh, close contact and no excuses. We have to get those guys prepared to play, you know? Like, we got to get everybody on the same page. We shouldn't miss a beat from the ones to the twos to even the threes. And so um, this week this week off should get us a couple guys back, a couple guys to get their bodies right and, and get prepared for Big 12 play. And, just kind of smack in the face for us just to just to let us know that we we got to wake it up and it's here and we just got to go out and do our jobs. John yeah, Justin, from the middle of the second quarter on, it seemed like they really <clears throat> were able to move the ball quite a bit better against you guys. Was it any kind of adjustment they made or anything you can put your finger on? Um, uh, we just, us as a defense, we got to win our one-on-one -on -one battles. Um, I felt like they did they did a great job of winning the one on ones. Whenever they find a one on one matchup, they took it, and they did a great job of finishing the play. So we got to do better as a defense to to uh, execute our one on one battles, our one on one tackles, one on one going up for the ball, one on one anything. Just just being in our gap, being in place to make a play on the ball. We just gotta go out there and win our one on ones, and that's kind of one of the, one of the keys we was talking about on the sideline when the game was tied, and we just we just gotta go make a play whenever we can. How tough was it for you guys after Wayne gets hurt there at the end of the game in such a key situation to, to regroup and get back out there and try to play? Um, we I hope Wayne's okay. First of all, uh, I hope he's gonna recover fine. I hope that everything's all right and nothing seriously wrong with him because I know how that can be. And um. Wayne is a big piece in our defense. He's, if if I had to say, he's the second best communicator behind me, and he's he he can even correct me at times, and I, I appreciate him for that. And he's a he's a big part of this defense. And like I said, we got guys who, you never know who has to step up, especially with Corona going on and injuries on top of that, and guys getting more time than they usually would just because we don't have many bodies out there. We gotta we gotta get guys who can get in there and play play ball, whether that like I said, be the one, two, or three. Kellis. Hey Justin, when you're playing these teams and they uh, pull out trick plays on you like halfback passes and stuff, um, how can you stay more disciplined and defend those in the future? Um yeah, we gotta just be disciplined, read our keys. Like I said, we got no excuses, but we got some guys in there young and that just happen to that's never seen that type of stuff before, just never been on the field to have that type of experience. And so we just gotta uh make it in, not make any excuses and we just gotta go play ball, read our keys and get uh, get coached up and move on to the next play when the team does trick plays like that and we just gotta move on to the next play and just execute the next play. Don't down our heads and just be in the dumps after that. So we just got to get guys to execute, do their job, and we'll be fine.